and welcome. Today it's all about winter skincare for the face. A few things about winter skincare. It's a really good idea to have a humidifier in the home, but especially in your bedroom. Have that going all night because it helps prevent the trans epidermal water loss from your skin. So we need a nice humid environment in order to stop our skin from but if you don't out. have a humidifier, a bowl of water is just as good. Just as, well, nearly as good. Nearly <laughs> as good, sorry. But have a bowl of water near the bed, a nice medium-sized bowl of water. <laughs> as long as your dog doesn't stop <laughs> licking at it. Anyway, moving on from animals. You said not say husband. <laughs> moving on from husbands <laughs> it's also a very very good idea at this time of the year in fact i do this in all seasons i do one good double cleanse at night and in the morning i use my beautiful microfiber cloth to just wipe over the face with tepid water there really is absolutely no need to cleanse again in the morning number one it's quite drying because you're using a cleansing product and number two, there's nothing to take off. You've taken everything off the night before and there's nothing really there except for a fine film of your moisturiser and maybe a small amount of perspiration that accumulated during the night. So warm water in the morning with this is absolutely fine. We don't want to over cleanse in the winter. But these are brilliant, aren't they? Love like these, fibers. just love those. They're absolutely beautiful and they pick up, even with your double cleanse, they pick up all that makeup. They really get in there and cleanse the skin beautifully. It's a great idea too in the winter time to use lovely cleansing oils, rich balms and <laughs> lovely rich creamy cleansing milks. I, I do think that's very, <clears throat> very important because with the central heating on and even yeah. if you've gone out for a walk, you just feel that your skin is yeah. so dehydrated. Yeah, it is. I feel that it helps. <laughs> now talking about dehydration. She for a facial. <laughs> no, apart from you must come in for a facial, we're going to get onto this wonderful little spray later. Close your eyes and tell me what this feels like. Oh, that's lovely. <gasps> Beautiful. Pure mist. thermal mist, but we'll oh, talk about that in a minute. Lovely. So we've got the heater pumping out loads of heat. I'm excited to hear about that. You so, kept uh, that quiet I did. Me. She told me about the other products and to asked me so, to test them. But this them. is so lovely because you can this spray it directly one. onto the skin. Anyway, we'll get to that later. Another good idea is to reduce the frequency of your exfoliation. I thought she was going to say drinking. <laughs> <laughs> drinking alcohol. Well, alcohol is very dehydrating. I know. But... So reduce that too, ladies. <laughs> but I'm talking about reduce your exfoliation frequency and that's all your peels and your scrubs, but no one should be scrubbing their skin anyway. So basically I'm talking about your enzyme peels, I'm talking about your AHAs, your salicylic acids, your BHAs. So try and reduce those because we do actually need the protection yeah. on our skin during the winter. We don't want to strip it all back. But anyway, I've got some beautiful little products for you and we're going to go straight in with the Eucerin. It's the Eucerin Urea Repair. And this is beautiful, comes in a perfect little tube, which means, of course, our favourite thing, when you think it's all gone, you can cut it and get more out of it. This instantly hydrates the skin. I absolutely love it, especially in the winter time. It's very, very protective. And if you're out for walks or you're rambling, I don't, I don't know what you do in the winter time, but golly, if you're out there, you really have to put extra protection on the well, skin. Well, I was saying to Teresa that I'd come back from a walk and my skin felt really mm. tight and dry. Mm. And I put this on and instantly it yeah. was, felt hydrated. Instant and... relief. So this is beautiful. So it instantly hydrates the skin. It reduces the tightness and the roughness. It keeps the skin supple and smooth. And of course it contains, is it 5% urea? 5% urea. <clears throat> which is really, really good. And the urea binds the moisture to the outermost layers of the skin, like your epidermis. And also it naturally improves the exfoliation, yeah. which is good, which is why I've said cut back on your acids and your peels because if you're using this, this will do it naturally anyway. So it's just beautiful. When you have that tight, dry skin, 
this it was relieving. such a relief instant yeah. relief it was yeah. amazing literally and eucerin is so good at instant relief well, we, used, we scalp. used it for the scalp yeah. do you remember when yeah. my scalp was driving me mad put the eucerin on instant fantastic just loved it so it has as we said the urea and the lactate so they're two naturally occurring compounds that bind in the moisture so it's just gorgeous. Use AM and, how, and PM. How much would you use of that? I always use a lot of everything. So I would I use, use a it, lot of it. Yeah, I use AM and PM. Now, interestingly, you brought this up. When I wash my hair in the morning and I'm doing the old shower and it's running down the heart, because I live in a hard water area, I put a layer of this on straight after. But then before I put my makeup on, I put on another layer. And you can apply it twice, oh, depending okay. on your skin. But you can use this AM and PM. But I do, I use a lot and I keep massaging yeah. it in. I keep yeah. using it. It's such beautiful. Thing. It's um, colour free, fragrance free. This is an absolute must to repair and hydrate that skin that has been buffeted by the wind and your, your winter time rescue. I do love that. Oh, love it to bits. And there's another couple that I love too. Now, talking about Eucerin, this, my darlings, is the Eucerin Lip Balm. This is brilliant. I absolutely adore this. This is so good. I messaged my daughter immediately with the photograph and I said, just go and buy this because she suffers from really dry, cracked lips. It really does moisturise the dry, cracked lips like nothing else. And it also helps to regenerate the lips natural protective barrier with the evening primer as well. But it has the also has the licorice extract, yes. which reduces the redness and skin irritation. So oh, it yeah. it's, it's just magic. And then they have the glycerol, which intensely moisturizes the lips and they just feel so soft and smooth. Now, this is an interesting one because it's also very, very good for use around the perioral area. So it just doesn't have to go into the lips. Put it all the way around. It's really, really good for things like like the lip lick eczema and if you're a little bit of a drooler at night time but we, then people get irritation no. because yeah. the saliva yeah, does irritate your skin <laughs> it's quite an irritant also you get dry lips from medication as well oh absolutely so we agree we both love this i love it and i think if you're going to buy any lip balm this winter Trust me, this is the one to buy. And that's easy to keep in your pocket as well mm. when you're going out. And do you know what? Have one in your pocket, one in the handbag, one beside the bed, going to bed at night. And I must say, when I first started using this, I put it on at night time. In the morning, I still had that lovely film around my yeah. lips. As much as I love it, please ensure your lips are dry before you apply this. Uh, this is the La Roche-Posay Cica Plus Foam B5 SPF 50. Nine pounds for 40 mils is specifically formulated for superficial skin irritations and damaged skin. Again, ladies, always be very aware. You go on a brand's website, then you look at their packaging, it says two different things. So it tells you that it's suitable for adults, children and babies, but the packaging states the babies have to be over three years old. Now, to me, that's a toddler, not a baby. But however, this is where the website and the packaging differs. So it can be used on everyday skin irritations. It's ideal on sensitive skin, and we all have sensitive skin in the winter time. Now, you can use it on chapped lips, but the packaging <laughs> says to avoid the lips. So I think we should all have a little play with it and decide what well, works right best for us. us yeah. But I think if you've got chapped lips, where's my beautiful Eucerin? I'd be putting that on, not a cream. So this is a really good one for post-cosmetic peels. So after your peeling treatment, you can pop this on, reduces the redness, reduces sensitivity, heals and hydrates. And it, it does help with the risk of hyperpigmentation. Yeah. So this is great if you're going out for a winter walk, your SPF 50. If you're in the sun, somewhere lovely, hot and sunny and gorgeous, <laughs> they do recommend that you use a, a specific SPF designed for the face. Again, you put that over. So I don't know if you'd be using this in a hot, beautiful place, to be honest, but this is what the companies say. 
don't rely on this if you're actually going to a sun holiday. So that contains the panthenol 5%, yeah. doesn't it? Also known as the B5. Yeah. So again, soothing. famous soothing and anti-irritant. So it also has the Cantonella Asiatica, which is an antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and it's kind of a bit of a hero ingredient in a lot of the products now, isn't it? And of course, it has the glycerin, which is shea the greatest butter. humectant on earth, and the, the shea, shea butter. butter, and of course, the La Roche-Posay Thermal, thermal Spring, spring Water. <laughs> and it has the zinc, which is anti-inflammatory. These guys have literally thought of everything, haven't I they? I just think they need to clarify all the little points we talked about <laughs> earlier. It would be nice if the website married up with the packaging. And it has the patented ceramide that has, helps to suppress brown spots due to the excessive production of, of melanin. melanin. Yeah, absolutely. And it has the copper, very important. So you've got the zinc for your anti-inflammatory. And then you've got the copper, which is for anti-aging. And it's so important to increase the production of collagen. So it kind of restores all that fibroblast activity. It's also um, an antioxidant and it's a biocide. So it prevents microbial growth on the skin, which is another great thing That's about amazing, this. It's just, it? oh, it's just an amazing product. But it's, it's great for sensitive, irritated skin yeah, and because it's soothed and it's comforting the skin, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. But however, don't use it, please, on skin that has been deeply wounded. Not a good idea. But, you know, this, gosh, everything in one little and tube you know of cream. what I liked about that? It's non-greasy. Yeah, I it is. I love that. But the texture, you... the texture's interesting. Let me just pop this on you. It kind of, oh, I've put far too much on. Give me some. There's a that. surprise. <laughs> There's a surprise, Tessie and her, too much product. But it goes on and you think, oh, it looks a bit white. And would there be a white cast on that, especially like for women of colour? But no, no. trust me, that <laughs> absorbs, absorbs very quickly. so beautifully. That. Do you know what? I love it too. Really love it. Just use it. If you've got like dry, itchy spots on your neck or your back or your arm, anywhere at all, pop it on. Now, the big thing is, because it's SPF 50, please do not use it at night time. This is daytime use only. And also avoid the eye area. Mm. You have to be very careful with the eye area. Yeah, you do. You know, like everything else, I know that there a lot of there is a school of thought that says you can put moisturizer all around the eyes, blah, 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 blah. But when a brand tells you not to, please follow the brand's advice because they tell you not to for a reason. I think basic moisturisers, you probably could get away with it. But as you know, we are big fans of dedicated products for dedicated areas. Now, the Evine is absolutely beautiful. Just hold this up to you. This is a restorative and protective cream, £8 for 40 mils, total bargain. Brilliant for sensitive skin, delicate skin. It's restoring and purifying active ingredients, immediately soothes skin discomfort and promotes the restoration of sensitive dry it's, it's, skin. It is fabulous. It oh, really it's just is. a dream. Put this on and let me know what you think of this. So I, this I just love this. This cream, it protects, nourishes, soothes, mm. it does everything and helps replenish dry skin. Yeah. Now, do you feel the texture is slightly lighter than the La Roche Posay. Yeah, it's yeah I do too. Right. So again, I'd be putting on probably two coats of this, let one absorb, and if it's really cold outside and windy, I'd be putting on two coats it of this. It does feel a little bit sticky. But you know why? Because that is their dressing. They call that the dressing. Mm. That's the dressing effect. I don't but, know if I love that. Oh, but you know what? That, that dissipates quite quickly and then you just have a very fine film. So it's also suitable for um, intimate areas, any sort of dry irritation you have on intimate areas. And obviously you'd keep that the external part of the intimate area. Great for nappy rash. Yeah, I, I heard that. I yeah. saw that on your notes. Yeah, this yeah. has a thousand and one uses. So if the kids fall over or the grandkids fall over, you can use this on the wounds, you can use it on any irritation on the body or the face. 
I mean, it's just wonderful and post peel. It's great for use after minor dermatological treatments. Yeah, so. for laser or peels, anything at all, you pop this on and it's just so restorative. Immediately just calms and soothes. I just love it. So it replenishes, obviously, the skin's natural skin barrier. It's actually formulated with C plus Restore, which is a postbiotic active ingredient from the thermal mm. spring water. Yeah. And also it's got the antibacterial copper and zinc sulfate. So they are just wonderful again to keep that balance on the skin and not letting any naughty bacteria take over. So it's very soothing, fragrance free. And of course it has your mineral oil and your glycerin and your beeswax. And there's no SPF in this, so morning and night. And I think it's a really little handy tube to have in your first aid kit or in your bathroom cabinet, because wherever the irritation is or the dryness, pop this on and trust me, it will sort it out. So this is an interesting one. And why I picked this up, because it's handbag size. Ooh. And this is Your Good Skin. Actually, it's made for boots. But I've got to say, I really like this because not only is it an instant dryness rescue, this you can apply over your makeup. Yeah. So if you're out on walkabouts and you're all beautifully made up and you think, oh, my skin's getting a little bit dry, <laughs> you can actually pop this on. Or if you're out doing a big ramble somewhere in the Peak District or wherever, <laughs> put it in Just... your rucksack or your handbag and feel this texture shelter just stop everyone and say hang on just say darling i'm going to moisturize <laughs> oh that's lovely and the texture is wonderful oh, is very very light and it absorbs so quickly so of course that's why it's ideal for you and it's, this over is, makeup this is formulated with green tea and it hydrates mm. and calms it's yeah. lovely it's just beautiful and you get that hydration for 24 hours and it has the vitamin yeah. c and, and the e, e. I and it's, it's just... got the japanese lily turf ingredient which is hydrating and calming and of course as usual it has gold standard glycerin our wonderful humectant always look for glycerin and to be fair it's always in top of the list of most beauty products isn't it and it's got the shea butter which is rich in antioxidants your yoba seed which as you know is an excellent emollient paraben free non-pore blocking it's just suitable for every skin type including sensitive so yeah we like that too as a handbag goodie yeah. so talking about thermal waters here we have the Avene thermal spring water and it is absolutely beautiful it sounds handbag lovely. size i love mils, this product and it's just under five pounds but you know what the mist now shopper the mist oh it's oh, just i love that oh you can put it over your this makeup room is so hot. this room is like a sauna it's unbelievable <laughs> and this is lovely so we've put copious amounts all over our face and hair and i'm sure it's very good for us naturally soothing anti-irritating and anti-inflammatory and you could use that as part of your skincare routine yeah. or you can use it independently you can now i would use this when i come out of my shower when i come into my dressing room i would use this as a spray and then immediately the skin is damp i pop on my serum and pop on my moisturizer it is absolutely gorgeous. Apparently, it reduces your skin's sensitivity by 30% in just five minutes. Sounds and that's because it contains it? all these wonderful natural ingredients. Well, you think that would be good for a, a fair journey? journey. Yeah. yeah, on the aeroplane, pop it in your bag. Totally legal because it's only 50 mils. And just sit there and hydrate your skin as you go on your lovely sunny holiday. So... We just love all of these products and which ones are our favorites so my favorite is i have to say i love this and i love the lip balm i yeah, love these i love that lip balm it's the only one i love all I've, the products I've I've you've found. made really good oh, choices I there i, I, I just love, love them too. these are all great for winter skin i wouldn't be using these now in the summer to be honest i'd be using different products well but maybe just think, this one I would definitely use that in the summer and yeah, I would use the, the, the lip, lip balm, balm in the summer because yeah. I'm always dry. Now, the, the others, I think I would be saving for winter. However, I would put the Avene 
into my first aid kit or into the bathroom cabinet. Great for little skin irritations anywhere on the body or yeah. the face. Yeah. So I kind of love them all, and uh, <laughs> I, 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 I don't want to. I know I don't want to give them up. I don't know which one is my favourite because you need to choose one. The Eucerin. Yes. That's what I like. <laughs> oh, I, but I, I want them all. But never mind. But well, you so, have them all, so I, I've got them all, so I can just enjoy these all winter long. So, ladies, can you let us know which one you use and why, and and how you feel about it? Because we're always interested to read what you actually we do. Think. Like to know what you think. Yeah, yes. we do. And any pros or cons or any tips you have for us. So that's it. Thank you for subscribing and for liking and we'll see you the next time. Meanwhile, take care. Bye-bye.